All right, y'all. You asked for it. We got it. A Corvette Z06 versus a 2020 Shelby U500. Both cars are stock. What is up, fam? How this message finds you all well and great spirits? Well, uh, we're gonna see what the Hulk runs full weight. If you do recall, we ran the 10 fives without the passenger seat in. So today we're gonna run the car, the full tank gas, full 93. Let's see what happens. All we gotta do is this. <sighs> Just found out this. I haven't changed the oil yet. It's time. You're supposed to actually, I found out, you're supposed to change the oil after 500 miles. Um, the car has close to 4,000, so oops. Uh, so we had to get 12 quarts of five W50 motorcrafts. We're gonna head over to the Ford dealership, grab that, then haul over to Casper's, and then we're gonna do a little oil change there. And uh, we're gonna talk to Casper's about what they think too, about, ooh, should we twin turbo this? I don't know, still up in the air, let's see what they say. Let's get a cold start. Oh, hmm, where are my manners? Please, please, please. We are almost just a little over two months away, a little over 60 days away from the giveaway of the 2020 500 That's right, you buy a sign like this, on the website, mylonmerch.com, or you buy a little bracket for your cell phone, you can get a 2020 GT 500. So check it out, mylonmerch.com. I digress, let's get into the video and let's do our cold start since uh, it's gonna be loud. <laughs> All right, y'all, this is the first oil change for Hulk. The closing is Friday. I came over and said, Todd, I need an oil change. He said, all right, pull her in. Uh, just, I did get the oil prior because I wanted to get it done eventually, but we drove 3,500 miles on the same oil. She's supposed to do it at 500, but we got 5W50, uh, 12 quarts, a motorcraft, and a filter. So let's see how this oil looks. Poor Mason, this is Friday night. He just worked all week and I'm making him change the Hulk's oil. Dude, the oil alone and the filter was like 150 bucks. I was like, gosh. Yo, what do you think about this twin turbo thing, bro? What's everybody's opinion? What it's 50 50, think? dude. People say leave it as is, people I'm, say I'm go for it. Leaving it as is. All right, I value your opinion a lot, bro. They're so do. Why? They're, they're built with a supercharger for a reason. Yeah, yeah. And I mean, turbos are cool and all, but it's, it's not instant. So you got Mason's vote. Mason said, nah, on the snails. Vote, I'll put the poll up. But for now, let's see how dirty this Hulk's oil is, dude. There it goes. This was used to... Uh, 12 quarts. 12 quarts. This was used to beat the red eye and lose to uh, the fox body. It's still, it's still clean. <laughs> it's dark, but it's still clean. It's still clean, pretty much. Of considering. Race car with warranty. Exactly, that's exactly, <laughs> that's exactly word for word. Race car with a warranty is what Mason said. Yeah. You see how I get that from? Okay. Yeah, race car with a warranty. Damn. Yeah. And as many pulls as you pull? Yeah. Oh, we already did almost 40 passes already. And Ford's okay with that? Yeah, you're allowed. You're allowed. I mean, people think this is a racetrack. Take it to the drag. It has a drag mode, you know. <laughs> I mean, that is what it's built for. When the filter comes out, I want to. Can we look at the inside? I just want to see if there's any. You know. Yep. It's literally brand new still. Filter looks great. I can still see the color of the filter in it. All right. Road tripped it. Drag raced it. Looks good. All right. So. We drained the oil in the hull and changed the filter. Everything looked good. Now we're gonna dump 12 quarts of motorcraft into the hulk. Woo! 
First change. Feeding the beast. Stay with the forge stuff. Yeah, yeah. Plus, little, if there's any anti warranty issue, yeah. I have a video. Like, we use more craft stuff. It's a little bit more expensive, but you probably find it a little cheaper on You could. Amazon. You could. I can't save 30, 40 bucks, but that's that's then getting gotta it. That's got to wait like a week or two. Then you got to wait for yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Amazon special. <laughs> Just like that. Yes, sir. She done. So Hulk's first oil change is complete. We'll start her up. We're gonna eventually, we're gonna take him to the track. We're gonna take him to Echo. Expensive to do oil change. I'll probably keep it at every three to 4,000 miles. So we got the oil change on the Hulk. Thumbnail time, hold on. All right, bro. All right, we made it to Akko. Let's get our test pass in, see what the car does, and we also can take a look at some of these cool Mustangs. <laughs> what the draggy says so the draggy says that we did a 10-7 on full weight so let's see what the actual ticket these draggies are pretty uh pretty accurate uh from you know my understanding so let's see what it says here as we have a Z06 Corvette versus the Hulk. All right, so we just both did test passes. Z06 went 10.7, 133. I went 10.7 at 130. 130, I went 10.7, 133. So, so we're basically the, the identical. Both cut 17s because we're on street tires. And uh, it should be fun. Nice. It'd probably be a tie. <laughs> But it'd be cool just to see these cars together. Yeah, yeah, you know? absolutely. So what year is this again? This is up 15. 2015. Bone stock. Bone stock Z06. On shitty tires. <laughs> Same here. Uh, 2020 Bone Stock GT500. I have a Toyo. It's not a drag radio, yeah. but uh, I can't spin too high. I put a launch control to 2600. I can go at 35, 32, I'm sorry. But hey, I'm just going to be spinning. Yeah. So we, car, Thanks, man. I appreciate it. This will be fun. Uh, you guys will get to see this beautiful car. Well, here we go, guys. Z06 supercharged. Again, you know, we spoiled the surprise. We both already, we both ran 10.7s. 
Um, so yeah, here we go. This should be fun. All right, y'all. You asked for it. We got it. A Corvette Z06 versus a 2020 Shelby U500. Both cars are stock. As you can see here, this is a beautiful, beautiful setup here. Oh man, this is a beautiful car. And of course we have the Hulk. And something different, if you guys watch this channel, you normally race full weight, but to make you guys, we, we put in the seats just to show you guys what this car would run uh, full weight. So we're excited. Uh, beautiful cars, see what they do. But, uh, so far, these cars both run 10.7, 10.6-ish. So very close uh, race. Beautiful. Z06. They're both on street tires here. He's got the Michelins. Uh, just so you guys know, we both uh, already ran, ran 10.7. So we shall see what happens. Beautiful Corvette Z06 supercharged. We're full weight. We are gonna have some fun, see what these run. Um, looking forward to this matchup. Uh, this car definitely has a weight advantage, but I have a horsepower advantage. So we'll find out what happens. We'll see, it should be fun. Uh, stay tuned. Comment below what races you want me to have. This was actually a request from one of the GT500 forums was to get a Z06 versus a 500 so we're here we're both stock and uh let's have some fun Let's see what it was. I think that was a better pass. Thank you. So, all right. So the the light was so bad. <laughs> the light was so bad. Uh, ten seven to a ten nine. So there we go. We gotta run that back. That light. That light sucked. Good, good pass. That was a good. You want to run it back? Yeah. Yeah. I. I, I was bad for me too. So. All right, we'll run it back. <laughs> so, uh, we both are gonna run it back because we both run happy. He went ten nine, and I went ten seven, and I cut a horrible light. <laughs> I was just sitting there. Uh, you know, you're trying to get on, make sure all the camera stuff is ready. You do kind of. Uh, 1079 at 132. So we're gonna have some fun and, and run it back a couple more times and see what happens. So there we go. Our first pass uh, was 109 to 107. 
130. Now this is full weight, so we don't have our secret sauce of uh, you know how we like to actually run. So let's run it back and see what happens on the next pass. 10 7 10 9 so he went 10 9 i went 10 7 we're gonna run it back though because he said like i did that we had some slip ups so we're gonna run it back and see what happens so let the cars cool off means because if you see behind me there is a ca corvette that has just got here Woo! Looking. It looks good, dude. It looks really good. D500. Uh, I did some like appearance things with the like, Shelby Beautiful sign. Yeah, we went. Uh, it's so cool to see these cars together, though. I yeah. think it's good. This is so cool. But yeah, yeah. Right. lime gr grabber lime. This isn't the track pack. This is the base car. Okay. Seven speed dual clutch. Seven sixty horsepower. Um, seven speed. Seven speed dual clutch. Seven speed, okay. So okay. you you obviously guys if you don't know this has an eight speed dual clutch, seven speed. Yep. I so love it. I love it, man. the one thing I will say, I mean you're gonna drive it, it's a little bit slow off the line with the dual clutch for me. This one, this this again? this one, yeah. Okay. So we might be does I, that launch control? It does. It does. Okay. But it's still there's a little bit you'll see it. A little bit of delay. A little delay. Okay. I'm used to like my GT is like go. Yeah. This is a little it catches a little bit slower, okay. but Interesting. you'll you'll fight you'll figure it out. Yeah. We're gonna have fun today. We're, we're gonna learn our cars together but uh, this should be good. Uh, the blue car is gonna come in front of me so we can line up with that and then we'll be lined up. Perfect, perfect. So we're still learning, but. Uh, yeah, man, thanks for you know, East Coast Super Target on Instagram. We're East Coast Super Target on Facebook. You know, check us out, check out our I'll website. I'll put a link in description on, the, on this video. East Coast Super Charging, check them out. Yep. Uh, when I get mine, we'll hang out, but today you're gonna see this, this red is fire. Oh, it looks so good, man. Congratulations and good luck thank out you, there, bro. Point zero seven, so a ten seven at one thirty two for the whole and an eleven six eight nine for the Corvette. All right, good pass. Appreciate it. Check them out. East Coast Superchargers. We'll be back. We'll be back. All right. Take care, take care, man. Beautiful. All right, just to wrap up this video, yes, we uh, kind of traded up here on the Z06 when the C8 showed up, but wanted to thank the gentleman who drove the Z06. He did run a 10.7 flat. That was his best time. Didn't get that pass because that was a, not against me, but really respect his time. And the C8 ran a best of 11.5 at 120 that day. So enjoy, like, and subscribe because you guys know it never ends. Peace.